The Supreme Court Monday rejected former Enron CEO Jeffrey Skilling's second bid to overturn his conviction on charges of conspiracy, securities and accounting fraud, and insider trading. He is currently serving a 24-year prison sentence for his role in Enron's bankruptcy in 2001 and is convicted on fraud charges related to the Houston energy giant's downfall. Former Enron chairman Ken Lay was also convicted for lying to investors. The justices said in a unanimous decision in Skilling's first trip to the Supreme Court in 2010 that the legal theory prosecutors used to convict him, known as honest services theft, only covers bribes and kickbacks, not fraud. But when the case was sent back to the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals in Texas, a three-judge panel said in April 2011 that the prosecution's error was harmless and that the jury had overwhelming evidence that Skilling conspired to commit securities fraud. The justices gave no reason for rejecting Skilling's petition to overturn his conviction. Jessica Minton, IB Times TV.